Thank you for your interest in the Mileage Smart program. My name is Kip, and I'm the Automotive Administrator here at Capstone Community Action, one of five community action agencies statewide that are participating in this program. And my name is Liz. I'm an accredited financial counselor, and Kip and I are gonna walk you through a series of training modules, and we'll talk about program requirements, hybrid versus conventional, and we'll also touch on budgeting. We're also gonna take a look at credit and how it affects your ability to get a loan, types of hybrid vehicles, research methods, what to expect at the dealership, and test drives. The Mileage Start program was enacted by the Vermont Legislature and is backed by VTRANS and the Department of Environmental Conservation. Our mission at Mileage Smart is to help low-income Vermonters get out of older, lower efficiency vehicles into more economical, higher mile per gallon used vehicles. If you meet all the requirements, you may qualify for an incentive of up to $5,000. First, you have to be a Vermont licensed resident with an income of at or below 80% of median income. And if you don't know what that is, you can check it out on our website. There's a resource page for the link. You have to be 18 years or older, and you cannot be a dependent on someone else's income tax. Additionally, you must be employed or on disability or over 60 years of age. And you have to have enough income to be able to afford a loan if a loan is necessary for the purchase of the vehicle. There are also some requirements on the vehicle. First off, the vehicle has to be used and it must get the minimum of 40 miles per gallon combined according to the EPA when the car was new. And it must have a clean title and be purchased at a Vermont dealership. Sorry, no private sales. Yeah. The sales price on the vehicle cannot be over NADA high book value and it is for primary vehicles only. No second vehicles unless there is another qualified licensed driver in the household. The incentive you receive will be 25% of the purchase price up to $5,000. Lastly, you can use the incentive to pay down existing loan on your current vehicle up to the total of your incentive. So if you go to trade in your current vehicle and you still owe $4,000 to the bank, the dealership says they'll give you $2,500 trade in value. You still owe the bank $1,500. And let's say the car you're looking to buy offers an incentive of $3,000. $1,500 of that would go towards paying off your old car loan and $1,500 would go toward the new car. If you owe more than your incentive's value, you're responsible for paying the difference before you can get the new to you vehicle. Thank you for your interest in the Mileage Smart program. There will be a series of training modules with quizzes that you will need to complete before you can apply for the program. The modules take about an hour to complete. Good luck and be, be mileage, mileage smart. smart.